Hey, welcome back to Homegrown Country Homestead. How y'all doing? Well, we're finally uh, getting around making a video. Uh, and today's video, I guess, is going to be about uh, why we haven't been making any videos. <laughs> One, is because Tasha doesn't know how to make any videos. And two is because I've taken a new job and I'm driving a truck over the road. And uh, most time I'm gone for over three weeks. And uh, so that's the main reason why we have been making videos. And one part of it is uh, going to stay the same. I'm probably going to be over the road for at least three weeks at a time. And the other part is maybe Tasha, you know, maybe we can teach her how to uh, make some videos and put some videos up every once in a while and then maybe when I come home uh, we can do a video but uh, that's what's uh, been going on probably over a month now you know been uh, been uh, doing a new job and uh, that's something that's uh, in the foreseeable future it's going to be that way for a while anyway um, long term goal is obviously to uh, get back home take a local job but uh, as far as now you know that's what, what I'm going to be doing there uh, miss m doing the videos uh, uh, definitely miss being around the home and everything because um, Tasha she's been taking care of the, everything around here as um, far as the gardening and stuff like that she's uh, well, what have you done as far as you know, canning yeah. and stuff I've made uh, like Connie sauce and tomatoes and uh, you made some tomatoes well canned some tomatoes okay I wasn't sure if she said she made tomatoes I'm not I'm not really sure what she's talking about canned tomatoes and made some pickle relish and uh, put up some peas and butter beans and so okra our, our garden did, did pretty good this year uh, watermelons uh, they didn't do any good. The cantaloupes, they didn't do any good. Um, not really sure why on that part. Well, the watermelons, we don't, we normally don't do too good with watermelons anyway. It's just a, it's not like it's a trial and error thing, you know. Most time they, they grow so big and they, they rot. And uh, cantaloupes, I'm not really sure. Maybe the grass just took over on that, I think, on the cantaloupes. It was just so dry. We tried to get the same water. A lot of uh, dry weather this year. Um, I guess everything else done pretty good though. It has. Uh, a lot of peppers and you know corn did all right. Mm -hmm. We still got a late batch of corn coming out. Yeah, we planted some late corn. Um, like I say it. They. It's. I don't think it's gonna do as good as it we want it to be, but you know, we're gonna have some uh, late corn coming off, so we'll have that. But uh, we won't we just make this video today, just kind of give you a little update what's uh, been going on around here. And uh, also, like, give a shout out to uh, Cheap Homesteading. Uh, Y'all would go over and check uh, Pete out over there on his channel. He's got a real good channel, he's uh, trying to grow, grow his channel. Um, he does a lot of different videos on uh, beekeeping and uh, just all kind of ways of doing things around your homestead uh, in a cheap, cheap type manner, I guess you can say. Uh, do it yourself. You know, he's all about you know saving money, uh, doing stuff yourself. Uh, so uh, go over and check Pete out. I appreciate it, and uh, he's got a real good channel there. But uh, got anything else you want to? At today's video? It's not. It's glad that you're, you was home for your birthday. Yeah, I, I, I done had a birthday and I'm 40, 42 years old. 42. I thought I was 43. Tosh had to tell him I was 42 years old. <laughs> I'm trying to age myself and force my time. But, uh, yeah, I've been, been home uh, close to a week. Close to a week now, so that's unusual. Uh, that's, that's not going to happen normally. But just the way everything worked out this time, uh, I was actually able to uh, be home for a week. 
and I uh, enjoyed my time here and everything. And Austin, summer, they done started school. And Austin, he's in preschool now, and he's uh, riding a school bus and uh, trying to get used to that. Tasha has to take him every morning and put him on a school bus. He won't walk up there on his own, so she has to put him on a school bus every morning. So he's still trying to get used to that. That's uh, pretty funny. But, uh, but I guess he's glad to get off the school bus. Cause yeah, he gets he's, off on his he's own. He's happy to get off. But when it comes time to get on, he really doesn't want to go to school. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we just thought we'd bring y'all this short video. And, uh, well, let's see. You want to close out? You want me to close out? I'll let you close it out. All right. Well, from my family to yours, y'all have a blessed day. And we appreciate y'all watching. See y'all later. Bye-bye.